There are only ordinary people who are doing things that other people perceive to be extraordinary. There are no extraordinary people, there are only ordinary people that are doing things that other people perceive to be extraordinary. You're at this conference because your company thinks you've been extraordinary. You've excelled in sales. You've excelled in client services. You've excelled in other areas. And because of that, you have the opportunity to come to the President's Club. But as I've talked to you and as I've talked to other winners over the years, I have found that most of them say, I'm not an extraordinary person. I'm only an ordinary person doing things that other people perceive to be extraordinary. So how can you replicate what you've done? How can you help other people become extraordinary as well? In researching this, I noticed that in our culture, we give medals to two classifications of people, winners and heroes, winners and heroes. They both earn their medals through the same process, and I'd like to show that to you this morning using the letters in the word medal, M-E-D-A-L. What do each stand for, and, and how can you use those to help raise up other people to build other winners in your organization? So in closing, let's recap what we've talked about. The letters in the word metal. M stands for your mental attitude, that mentality of a winner, that positive mental attitude. A lot of us have been exposed to motivational books and speakers, but it's making that a part of your nature that has brought you to this conference, the M. The E is excellence. Excellence means you do what you do better than anyone else, better than your last performance. You're constantly looking at improving your ability. You use the highest standards to measure what you are doing. M, E, D. The D is diligence. You go back and you try again. As I talked to some of you last night, I heard your stories about the time you wanted to throw in the towel. You just wanted to quit. It was insurmountable odds. The competition was doing things you didn't think you could overcome, but you persevered. And because of that, you're here. This conference is your medal. The A is ability. Improve your ability next year. Because what brought you to the conference this year may not bring you next year. C, Q, I, continuous quality improvement. We have to do that in sales. We have to do that in every aspect of our lives. How will you go to the next level this year in your abilities? And then the L is legacy. What legacy will you leave behind? You heard my story. What will you leave in the hearts and the minds of the individuals that you influence? And one way you might want to consider measuring that is who will be at this conference next year? Who will make President's Club next year that didn't make it this year because of what you did to teach them?